Dear students, now we are in the chapter Quadratic Expressions in Mathematics 2A topic. Quadratic Expressions. discuss the sums examples solved examples before exercise 3b yesterday i said theorems <coughs> the concept depends upon theorems of quadratic expressions and uh, graphs and its uh, characteristics also we have discussed in yesterday class let us go into discuss about the examples depends upon the exercise 3b concept in ipe until yesterday, I, in yesterday class I said one example, page number 79, page number 79 example, <coughs> one and example two completed. Let us discuss examples, all examples I'll discuss. Example 3, page number 80, comma 81, example 3. For what values of expression? For what values of x? For what values of x the expression? The expression minus 6x square minus 6x square plus 2x minus 3 is negative. For what values of expression is negative? You should write for negative. For negative, the expression minus 6x square plus 2x minus 3 less than 0. Multiply with minus both sides, it becomes 6x square minus 2x plus 3 greater than 0. Whenever you are multiplying with minus to both sides, the symbol will become change. Greater than becomes less than, less than becomes greater than. 6, 3, 0, 18. Depends upon this 6, 3, 0, 18. Convert into factors. So there is no factor to get the middle term as 2. So better to take the value depends upon the minus b plus r minus root b square minus 4ac by 2a. Minus b means minus 2 here plus r minus root b square means 4 minus 4 6 are 24 3 is 81. So no need to calculate here. Here we should follow one method. Delta you calculate delta. Delta is equal to b square minus 4ac concept. b square minus 4ac. So 4 minus 4 into 6 into 3. 4 minus 4, 6 are 24, 3 are 81. 4 minus 81 becomes minus 77 less than 0. We have proved a theorem that if coef of x square and the expression having same sign when delta less than 0, for all x belongs to r, it is true. So, this function is valid for all real numbers. This is true for all real numbers. Now, we can write coef of if delta less than 0, if delta less than 0, comma, coef of x square, comma, expression. That is, we proved the second theorem that ax square plus b plus c comma a have same sign when delta less than zero for all x belongs to r. It is very very important theorem and concept we have discussed. In the based on this theorem, you can write if delta less than zero coef of x square. What is the coef of x square here? Six. It is positive. What is the expression? Total symbol is there greater than zero. It is positive. Like this also you can understand minus 6 is negative and this is also negative. Negative and negative. R positive and positive. Delta whenever 
if delta less than 0, this is the concept here, co f of x square and expression have same sign. Expression have same sign. For all x belongs to R. So no need to calculate where the value exists or where the value does not exist, where the x belongs to lie between or does not lie between. There is no question of lie between or does not lie between, depends upon this one. Because for all x belongs to, for everywhere, for every real number, it is true. What is true? For every real number, wherever the values of should, this is positive. Otherwise, this is negative, like that. This is IMP 2 marks on. Because depends upon the concept. Now, find the value of x for which the following have max or min. Find the value of x which the following expression have max or min. Find max or min I am writing. Example for the same page. Find max or min for x or min min means a quadrant expression may be maximum or may be minimum depends upon the coefficient of x square but not both so <coughs> find the maximum or minimum for here he is asking x square plus 5x plus 6 x square plus 5x plus 6 this is the expression x square plus 5x plus 6 given depends upon the co f of x square we can conclude that whether the function is maximum or minimum here you can write this is of the form a x square plus b x plus c here a is equal to 1 b is equal to 5 and c is equal to 6 a greater than 0 whenever a greater than 0 the function is minimum because already we have discussed the proof that a x plus b x plus c equal to 0 to whether the function is min or max we should calculate first derivative 2 a x plus b equal to 0 x equal to minus b by 2 a we got that whenever you have substituted the value x is equal to minus b by 2 a in the given expression we got the value as 4 a 4 b square minus 4 a c by 4 a c minus b square whole by 4 a we got the max or min value if a greater than 0 the second derivative greater than 0 then the second derivative decides that it is minimum when a greater than 0 when a less than 0 the second derivative decides that it is maximum so a greater than 0 here it is minimum simply directly you can write a greater than 0 whenever a greater than 0 f of x put here this name is f of x whenever a greater than 0 f of x is minimum whether it is absolute minimum or local minimum or anything you can write simply minimum f of x is minimum minimum yet remember the formula x is equal to minus b by 2a that is minus 5 by 2 that's all min value minimum value is equal to formula 4ac minus b square by 4a 4ac minus b square by 4a substitute the 4ac minus b square by 4a concept 4 into 1 into 6 minus b square means 25 by 4 a means 4 4 6 is 24 24 minus 25 minus 1 by 4 is the minimum value here now he is asking find the value of x is the following expression have only simply he is asking about value of x only in next step he asked maximum or minimum value also let us discuss Second example. Second example. Two x minus x square. We should calculate the function whether it is min or max. Where the function is max or min, and decide the value of min or max 2x minus x square plus 7 equal to 0 first of all you can write given f of x as minus x square plus 2x plus 7 if you given first coefficient of x are coefficient constant but you should write first first coefficient of x square only later a coefficient of x and later it is constant you should write 
Now you can write here a is equal to minus 1 and b is equal to 2, c is equal to 7. So f of x is maximum because a less than 0 here. f of x is maximum yet x is equal to minus b by 2a. Since you can write otherwise because because a less than 0. So, yet to x is equal to minus b by 2a means 2 by 2a. Simply, 2 by 2a is 1. Max value. Max value formula 4ac minus b square by 4a. 4ac. So, 4 into a means minus 1 minus 4 into 8 minus 28. Minus b square. So minus 4 by 4a means minus 4. Minus 20, 28, 4, 32, 32 by 4 gives 8. Otherwise if you substitute 1 here it becomes very easy. Minus 1 plus 2, 1 plus 7, 8. That is easy method. Next sixth question. Page number 81. Find the maximum and minimum value of the expression 2x minus 7 minus 5x square. 2x minus 7 minus 5x square 2x minus 7 minus 5x square in the similar way you can understand f of x is equal to minus 5x square plus 2x minus 7 right here a is equal to minus 5 b is equal to 2 c is equal to minus 7 since a less than 0 f of x has maximum f of x has maximum yet I mean maximum value yet x is equal to minus b by 2a for everything in exercise every sum a given homework students you write like this for every value for every sum you should write the data and follow this method x is equal to minus b by 2a comma uh, that is equal to, I am writing, x is equal to minus b by 2a means here minus 2 by minus 2 into minus 5. So it is 1 by 5. Now you can write max value, maximum value of the given expression formula 4ac minus b square by 4a. You can substitute here also, otherwise write the formula also, no problem, you will be getting in the answer in the same way. 4 into a means here minus 5. C means here minus 7. Minus b square means minus 4 whole by 4a. 4 into minus 5. 4 into minus 5 into minus 7. 5 is 35. 35 fours are 140. 140 minus 4 by minus 20. You can write here minus 136 by 20. 2 table will be dividing minus 68 by 10. 4th table minus 34 by 5. Yeah, minus 34 by 3 he got. 4 into minus 5 is right. x is equal to 1 by 5, maybe we give a mistake, no problem, we can discuss second with some students. Depends upon the same concept, second sum, 3x square plus 2x plus 11. 3x square plus 2x plus 11. a is equal to 3, that is greater than 0, b is equal to 2 and c is equal to 11. I think here delta less than 0, there is no question of min or max. For every value, okay, we can understand. A greater than 0, if he is asking about the expression symbol, we can write the formula delta less than 0 concept. Here A greater than 0, therefore f of x is minimum. f of x is minimum, yet x is equal to minus b by 2a. That is equal to minus 2 by 2 into 3. That is equal to minus 1 by 3. 
min value min value 4ac minus b square by 4a 4ac means 4 into 3 12 12 into 11 132 minus b square means minus 4 by 4a means 12 132 minus 4 128 by 12 Fourth table will be dividing 32 times and 3 times. So 32 by 3 is the minimum value of the given function here. So 32 by 3 is the minimum value of the given function. Depends upon the concept of expression of quadratic expressions using the changes of sign we can do next sum. Page number 81, example 6. Example 6, page number 81. Find the changes of the sign for all x belongs to R and find the extreme value both. Find the changes of sign. Find the changes of sign of the function 4x minus 4x minus 5x square plus 2. 4x minus 5x square plus 2 for all x belongs to R and find extreme value and find extreme value given f of x I am writing given f of x is equal to 4x minus 5x square plus 2 given f of x is equal to 4x square minus 5x 4x minus 5x square plus 2 so whenever the function f of x is given you can write this one as first of all x square coefficient minus 5x square plus 4x plus 2 now we should calculate changes of sign so for positive and for negative both you should write for a positive you write first of all so it becomes minus 5x square plus 4x plus 2 greater than 0 whenever qf of x square is negative then you can multiply with minus both sides. You will be getting 5x square minus 4x minus 2 less than 0. 5 2 is 10. Depends upon this one. Now we have no proper fractions. You can write minus b plus r minus root b square minus 4ac by 2a concept. 4 plus r minus root b square minus 16. Minus b plus r is root b square minus 4ac. 4 5 is 20. 22 is 40 minus half minus becomes plus 40 by 10. So x is equal to we can write this one 4 plus r and 16 plus 40 becomes 56. 56 you can written as 4 into 14. 4 root 2. So 2 root 14 by 10 you can write and x is equal to in next step you can write 2 plus r minus root 14 by 5. Depends upon this concept, we can write this one in the way x minus 2 root 14 by 5. x minus 2 root 14 by 5 into x plus, first better to write plus here, x plus 2 minus root 14 by 5 and x minus 2 and x minus of 2 minus root 14 by 5 less than 0. We know that the formula x minus alpha and x minus beta less than 0, x belongs to alpha beta. So, x belongs to 
you can write here this is less than 0 then put open interval here 2 minus root 14 by 5 comma 2 2 plus root 14 by 5 so first minus you should write minus of 2 minus root 14 by 5 comma 2 minus root 14 by 5 that meaning is if x is positive if the expression is positive the x value lie between this values minus 2 of minus minus of 2 minus root 14 by 5 comma 2 minus root 14 by 5 now depends upon this concept for negative you can write directly that x does not lie between x does not lie between minus of 2 minus root 14 by 5 minus of 2 minus root 14 by 5 comma 2 minus root 14 by 5 you can write that one as x less than of minus of 2 minus root 14 by 5 comma x greater than of 2 plus 2 minus root 14 by 5 x less than alpha and x greater than beta concept next he is asking about extreme value also if there is no question of if co f of what is the value here ok right here if a is equal to minus 5 given as a is equal to minus 5 whenever a is equal to minus 5 f of x has maximum because a less than 0 then the function is maximum yet maximum yet x is equal to minus b by 2a substitute here it becomes minus b by 2a means minus 4 by 2 into minus 5 you can write as 2 by 5 find the max value maximum value of the given function using the formula oac minus b square by 4a what is 4ac here 4 into a means minus 5 into c means 2 minus b square means 16 by 4a means minus 20 here 4 5s are 20 22 is a 40 40 minus 50 16 56 you can write minus 56 by minus 20 get cancel fourth table 4 times and 5 times here minus and minus will be getting cancelled answer is the 14 by 5 <coughs> now we have entered into original quadratic expressions four marks concept this chapter belonging to six marks weightage in IPE so depends upon IPE weightage two marks chances are there completed already whatever two marks sums are there we said now originally we have entered into four marks sums let us discuss four marks of example 7 most IMP question and students some way students should get confused of course confused so that the none of any yeah sometimes students get confused by reading the problem also so that none of none of the values so that none of the values of the function show that none of the values of the function x square plus 34x minus 71 x square plus 34x minus 71 by x square plus 2x minus 7 over r over r lies between 5 and 9 lies between 5 and 9 here the student should try to understand that show that none of values of the function whatever the function he given over r lies between 5 and 9 this question some students used to understand like that the value lies between 5 and 9 it is exactly wrong none of the values first you should read this question carefully none of the values between over or our real number between 5 and 9 that meaning that other than 5 and 9 there is no value that meaning that the value lies between less than 5 and greater than 9 belonging to this function this is most IMP maximum IMP sums are from this chapter 
belong to this exercise only and this concept. That is why I am saying examples also. Example 7 and 8 also I will say. <coughs> the process of this types of question is let you should write. Let y is equal to you can write y is equal to x square plus 34x y is equal to x square plus 34x y is equal to x square plus 34x minus 71 by x square plus 2x minus 7 this question you may face in MSET also plenty of times such types of question asked in MSET even though it is lengthy problem its marks is only one mark in MSET even though you take half an hour or one hour or anything you should change the time in MSET you have to do this one in only one minute so like that the speed you should understand and you can do you should do in one minute only this sum you have to equalize for that society now take cross multiplication since this is first sum I am saying this sum in clear way cross multiplication this is the process students let y is equal to that function and taking cross multiplication you can get here x square plus 34 x x square y into x square plus 2x minus 7 equal to x square plus 34x minus 71 that implies we can multiply this y with x square x square y plus 2x into y minus 7y minus this taken this side minus x square minus 34x plus 71 equal to 0 that implies now we should write this function into a quadratic manner x square into y minus 1 plus x into better to take 2 common 2x into we can write y minus 17 y minus 17 minus of 7y whatever the function other than x square and x is there you can take common 7y minus of 7y minus 71 equal to 0 otherwise you can write 71 minus 7y also it is also better no problem Okay, better to write plus 71. First plus you write plus 71 minus 7 by equal to 0. This is a, we can write, this is a quadratic equation. This is a quadratic equation in X. For every sum we should observe while reading the question only that this belongs to R. Over R, R belongs to R, R real number, R defined on the real number. Otherwise, if X is real, like that the question arranges. Whenever he is asking the question to us that he will give the information that it is defined for real numbers. Now, you can write here, if X is real or if the expression is real, anything we can write. If x is real, otherwise if you write here 1, if 1 is real, you can write. If x is real or 1 is real, means the expression is, full expression is real valued function. If x is real, then we can understand that according to quadratic equation theory, if the function is real, then the roots of the quadratic equation are real and distinct using the concept that delta greater than equal to 0. Then now I am writing here a is equal to y minus 1 and b is equal to 2 into y minus 17 and c is equal to 71 minus 7y. Using delta the templates using delta greater than or equal to 0 I am writing here b square minus 4ac greater than or equal to 0. What is b square here? 2 into y minus 17 total whole square minus 4 into the a value is y minus 1 and c value is here 71 minus 7 by greater than or equal to 0 that implies next step we can write here 4 into y minus 17 whole square minus 4 into y minus 1 into 71 minus 7 by greater than or equal to 0 now you can write divide by 4y sorry divide by 4 both sides 
Now you can write by expanding this one y square minus 34 by plus 289 minus multiply this one minus 71 by minus 7 y square minus 71 minus of minus plus 7 y greater than equal to 0 next step y square minus 34 by plus 289 minus this is 71 by and 7 by 71 by yes 7 by 78 by minus 78 by and 7 by square plus 71 greater than or equal to 0. Next step we can write y square minus this is 78 and 34. 4, 8, 12, 1, 7, 1, 8, 8, 3, 1, 1, 2, 1, 1, 2 y plus this is 289 plus 71. 289 plus 71. This is 9, 1, 10. 7, 1, 8, 8, 8, 16, 1. This is 3. 360 greater than or equal to 0. Now, we should get the factors of y square minus 1, 1, 2 y. We got y square minus 1, 1, 2 y plus 360. There are no factors. Once again, we can verify that everything is okay. We should verify the factors. To y naught minus that y, ma y minus one whole square. Let us verify this one. Y minus one into x square plus two y naught minus thirty four. Yeah, it is okay. Minus 7y plus 71. It is also okay. B square minus 4ac greater than 0. Exactly right. 2 taken common. This is 2y minus 34. According to option, this is exactly right. 2 taken common. And 4 into y naught minus 1 into 7y naught. Plus, it's okay. We did not do wrong. Let us verify b square minus 4ac concept this is 2 square minus 4ac 4 into a means y minus 1 and this is 71 minus 7 by exactly we have done but we should verify the whether the factors what are the factors 1 1 2 and here he got 14 by plus 45 so it is absolutely right in the way we should get another factors Yeah, here we should write y square plus 7 y square is 8 y square. Yeah, this is 8 y square. Divide by 8 it is better. Yeah, divide by 8. Divide by 8 both sides. Now you can write y square minus 8 14 are. 8 4 is 32, 3 8 1 is 8 3, 12 1 12. y square minus 14 by plus 45 greater than or equal to 0. You can write y square minus 5 by minus 9 by plus 45 greater than or equal to 0. You can write y taken common y into y minus 5 minus 9 taken common y minus 5 greater than 0 equal to 0. Next step you can write y minus 5 into y minus 9 greater than or equal to 0. Therefore, whenever greater than or equal to 0, you can write y does not belong to open interval 5 comma 9. That meaning is that y lesser than or equal to 5 comma y greater than or equal to 9 or y belongs to Minus infinity comma 5 closed interval union 9 closed infinity open. Therefore, y now you can write none of the values lie between 5 and 9 other than 5 and 9. Like this, 
none of the values of the y power r lies between 5 and y. I am writing here y does not lie between y does not lie between 5 and 9. Y does not lie between 5 comma 9 or at last you should write none of the question or however the question given like that you should write none of the values none of the function y I am writing none of the function y over r none of the function y over r lies between 5 and 9 lies between 5 and 9 like this you should write the whole question, however, whatever the time I have taken, whatever the time you have taken, try to understand this you should do in M set in one minute. So speed steps you should do. Seven marks and four marks depart, depends upon academy textbook, plenty of times, plenty of sums they are giving in M set. Only for one sum shortcut is there, for not every sum shortcut is there, depends upon range value sums. asking only maximum value find the maximum value of the function find the maximum value of the function x square plus 14x plus 9 x square plus 14x plus 9 by x square plus 2x plus 3 x square plus 2x plus 3 over r while writing the question or reading the question only should observe he used to give it is over r or real values are for all exponents are like that he will give should let this is the process let y is equal to you can write x square plus 14x plus 9 by x square plus 2x plus 3 by 1 you put and take cross multiplication here I am writing x square y plus 2xy plus 3y minus x square minus 14x minus 9 equal to 0 let us take common x square into y minus 1 plus x you take common better to take 2 also 2x you take common it becomes y minus 7 plus at last 3y minus 9 otherwise 3 into y minus 3 is equal to 0 let it be 1. Since x is real you can write since x is real roots of 1 roots of 1 real or distinct real and distinct. real and distinct. That implies use delta greater than or equal to 0 concept. Now, in M set students, no need to write this one. This step you can write directly. Whenever you see the question, directly you should write this step and next no need to write this step. Like this you should write. Delta greater than or equal to 0 apply. Now, 4 into y minus 7 whole square minus 4 into y minus 1 into 3y minus 9 greater than or equal to 0 divide by 4 it becomes y minus 7 whole square minus of y minus 1 into 3 y minus 9 greater than or equal to 0. While practicing for objective you should write no need to this, this step next one this one next one this one. Now you can write y square minus 14 y y square minus 14 y plus 49 minus 3 y square minus 3y square minus 3y minus 9y becomes minus 12y plus 9 greater than or equal to 0. 
that implies pi square minus 14y plus 49 minus 3y square plus 12y minus 9 greater than or equal to 0 that implies y square minus 3y square becomes minus 2y square this is minus 2y this is plus 40 greater than or equal to 0 divide by 2 minus 2 it becomes y square plus y minus 20 less than or equal to 0 by minus 2 I have written now take the factors like this y square while doing the same sum in M set, this is first step, this is second step, students. This is second step, this is third step, this is fourth step. Like that should do. Y square plus 5y minus 4y. Then automatically you can understand and you can verify the options. Whenever lesser than equal to 0, it is lie between R, open interval or closed interval belonging to. Whenever greater than 0, the value does not belong to the concept. Now you can write y taken common y taken common becomes y plus 5 and minus 4 taken common within the brackets y plus 5 greater than or equal to 0 less than or equal to 0 here you can write y plus 5 into y minus 4 less than or equal to 0 you can write here according to options according to the formula x minus alpha and x minus beta lesser than or equal to 0 then x lie between alpha and beta then you can write y belongs to minus 5 comma 4 therefore here Minus 5 comma 4 is the range and minimum value is minus 5 and maximum value is 4. Therefore, according to the question, now you should write maximum value. Maximum value of the given function is 4. No need to confuse that, sir, 4a is minus b square 4a for this one, 4a is minus b square 4a for this one, like that you should not do. You should do, depends upon this one only. If you get the answer also, it is wrong way, it is wrong process. Now we have completed example sums depends upon the concept, range concept and minimum maximum concept and minimum maximum values and everything. Okay students, let us going to discuss the exercise 3B next class.